wait on it. The dog. Oh, yeah! First Come one of the on. year in the boat! What's up? Thanks for checking out uh, Iowa Plains and Outdoors. We're out for the second day of the opening weekend of South Zone Early. Uh, I'm out here with just me and Piper today. We just took the kayaks out. Um, similar to where we set up yesterday. A um, little bit little bit better spot. I think it's maybe a little more inaccessible to people like you know, that are walking in or big boats, stuff like that. So uh, I'm pretty happy with it. But we got about an hour, 45 minutes of shooting time, something like that. So we're going to have some coffee you know less than an hour less than an hour of shooting time so we're gonna have some coffee and hang out and uh we need to hopefully shoot in some ducks decent start again today. Uh, Mike's got another one in the water. Um, we've had a few that have just come over our shoulder or whatever, they just bombed right in. Um, we've got a few groups of teal working, which is good. The action is a little bit slower today than it was yesterday. It's kind of expected. Um, there's been enough around though to keep us interested. Uh, there's quite a few teal earlier in the morning. Been a few pairs of big ducks and stuff like that flying around. So, enough to keep us interested anyway. Piper shot one. We missed a few. Uh, I think I might go shoot some clays next weekend. My shooting is making me frown. So. Didn't take a lot of shots because didn't want to lose them back in the weeds. So. Right, yeah, and like. The, the teal are coming at us like over our shoulder. They're not coming into the decoy spread right here. They're coming like at our shoulders and going around behind us and busting us. So, I don't know. I always think that that's bad news. It's game over when they go around behind you. So yesterday, uh, the bolt in Piper's gun just like exploded. Like on his last duck, it was just bad. bad. It was bad. So he went and got himself a loner gun might be his new permanent gun. It might be. My dad, uh, dad's got a Benelli M1 he's had forever, and he's not really doing any bird hunting, so loan out to me, and, you know, here's luck. It's uh, got, a, got a fully functioning bolt. <laughs> so I'm going to be uh, using this for probably the rest of the year since there's no way I'm getting my Remington back before probably December. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, be a be a good time. Good gun. It works. Yeah, it's always a, a plus when your gun works. <laughs> In you go. Oh, I think it's going to do it. I'm just going to get my foot out. Oh, I, yeah. I think you got it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Holy crap. So, Piper just got a new otter sled. And he's giving it the weight test. I'm 250 pounds without waders on. <laughs> and I still have, what, six, seven inches around the rim? Yeah, not for water use. Yeah, it says it right, it says it right here. <laughs> His sled says not for water use. Yeah. He works just fine in the water. I was starting to do my video outro, and there might actually be, like, ducks in the background <laughs> of the outro. Um, yeah. Anyway, nothing's wanting to work, case in point. We're picking up, we're getting out of here. Um, but we'll, we have kind of a split here in Iowa where for our duck season, so we have three more days to hunt, the weekdays. I think I might go out one or two of them, and then we got like a week and a half off or so, and then it's the North Zone late opener, um, which I think we're gonna be back out for that. So make sure to like, comment, subscribe to Iowa Plains and Outdoors. I got quite a few hunts coming up this year. Um, and I don't know, I might even do some deer hunting videos later in the year, but I got plenty of duck hunting videos too. 
So thank you guys for tuning in and uh, make sure to stay tuned for what I got coming up later in the season.